Hello, amazing people. My name is Montetti Masebe. I am a composer and pianist, and I look forward to giving you this challenge today. So, what I would like from you is to do a sound walk and following from that build a harmonic structure of that. So, what is a sound walk? Basically, a sound walk is when you walk through nature. Um, anything really just walk on the streets just walk outside you can even be inside your house if you want and you observe sound instead of interacting with it or producing sound with your voice or movements or anything like that um you would walk around for about like five minutes really and um, pay attention to sound if you want to record on your phone with it in your pocket or something you can do that as well and i will be giving an example of this as well so that it's easier to note so we go for a sound walk after that we build a harmonic structure let's go so i'm about to begin the sound walk now So I'm going to play a snippet from a piece by a composer named Kanisile Peterson. It's a string quartet called Minor Motley and she also used the same um, style that I've just suggested in the challenge. She worked with birds, specifically the minor bird, and um, put together a harmonic structure based off of the transcriptions that she had made from the bird. Some of the techniques that you can hear in this piece have colenio with the violinist um, playing colenio um, batuto I think um, where they are plucking with the wood onto the string and um, that is matched up against the very collapsing glissandi style um, just arco playing from from the viola and second violin and then with the cellist playing um, pizzicato on the strings so all of that you can see the different textures which creates a really ambient mood of um, nature and so just working off a style in that nature would be a really nice exercise for you to see how to build um, a song using the sources not being um, a song that you know or harmonies that you hear in your head but rather sounds that are around you so i hope you enjoy this challenge and it's not too overwhelming you can email me or contact me if there's any questions that you have furthering this challenge and i'm sending you the best of luck